Hey YouTube, this is Taco Jones here and with a resin update. And um, I wanted to show some of my pieces have been glazed and some of them have not. So here we go. Alright, I did some puzzle pieces. Did some um, glitter shapes and some chunky glitter. Did this one. And I really like this mold because they come out shiny. And I did this one. And I did this one. Maybe I should do it. There we go. And this has the glow in the dark glitter in it. And I did this one. I did some dead fish. And this mold you have to be careful with because they, um, to me they, it's hard to get out if they're not all the way cured. So, and then I heard that you can put Vaseline in them. So that's what I'm going to do from now on. So this has some glitter in it. And I dripped some resin in the little X. So this one has been coated with um, um, with resin. So that's why it's shiny. So I did a white one. And I did, I finally painted my Hello Kitty heads. So I'm over here. There's this one, this one with the pink bow, there we go, another one with the red bow, and this one I did kind of thin, so, but it seems to be alright, no bending, so, I was going to put more resin on the back, but, and this one has been glazed with resin, so I have to clean up the back where it dripped down. And I did this one with the pink bow. And I did a big one. And I did one with the purple bow. And I did a black one. And I got some more things over here. I need to pull it off. I'm in my kitchen, so sorry. I'm trying to reach over and be in lazy today. And not get I'm trying to pull everything. Sorry, guys. Wait just a second. I should have pulled everything over. Okay. Now, some of these, um, these ones I'm going to show are from um, Cat's Perfect molds that I got. And so I did the sneaker. And I'm going to paint this. So I just did in plain white. So I'm going to paint the stripes and the little heart. And then I got the Ugg boot. And I have to clean this one up. It needs to be sanded. But I really like it. It's so cute. And then these are from the House of Ink Houston mold. Um, I got the brass knuckles and I put the glow in the dark glitter in this and some other various glitters with the black um uh alcohol I'm um, sorry not alcohol inks the acrylic inks from Dale or Ronnie I got them from dickblick.com and this is from Megan Beads mold the tie and I did some um what is this? Lightning bolts. So I got those. Really nice. And this is from the House of Ink Houston's molds. I got the pan um not the panda. What is this? The paw prints. Sorry. And I'm gonna paint the little in little things. I made two of those just in plain white. And I got the moustache 
moustache or mustache so I did that and I over poured this one so it's gonna be probably to clean this one up it's gonna take a moment because it's all the curves and stuff so next time I have to be more careful not over pour so I did some bows and I only glazed one side of this because I was holding it this side so I gotta glaze the other side so both nice and shiny here's another bow and I did this dead fish another one and I mixed I was trying to do put pink and black but the black overtook the pink so this is what it came out with and then I did a pink one with glitter and I did a little brass knuckles and they're hard no bending little tiny ones they're still cute and this is the crossbones I think I've showed this before but I finally glazed it with some resin and then I did another bow and this one I have to glaze with resin I did one side this side so you can see a little bit of the difference but this mold is shiny on the inside so oh and then my two cupcakes I did these are from candy molds so I did this one and I painted it. These were plain white and I still have to glaze the bottom. I glazed the top so the um, bottom has to be glazed. And then I did this one and I still have to glaze the bottom. I glazed the top with resin. So there's that and that's all I have for today. Um, I will be doing a package opening from a trade as well today. So stay tuned for that video. Alright, have a good day. Thanks for watching. Bye-bye.